Saint Jose Maria's prayer to Our Lady of Guadalupe at the Basilica of Guadalupe in Mexico, on May 24, 1970. I don't have words to express my great, great joy at being here with you, Mary. My children, I call you to witness before God that I want to tell her who is our mother, whose children we are proud to be, that I have come here because, more than ever during these months, I want to pray to her not to abandon the church, and not to abandon us. I know she can't ever leave us, but I am begging her to cut short the time of trial, the storm that is beating on the ship of Peter. And I am appealing very especially, constantly, to her intercession, because I trust her with all the strength of my soul. Through Our Lady's hands, through her who is all-powerful in her supplication, I also need to say to God the Father, God the Son and God the Holy Spirit, that I place myself before the Blessed Trinity in total submission, in unreserved self-surrender, and I repeat, in a sincere prayer, the acceptance of God's will that she showed with her fiat, be it done. And so I'll go away giving thanks. Our Lady, I surrender myself, I surrender myself totally, I'm not asking for anything anymore. I love your son's will. We abandon ourselves, we rest, we love and accept your design, obeying God's will in full. We know, mother of ours, that you will give us the means to take forward this path of charity and love, and to spread it throughout the world. We have had these get together so close to your picture, nine days of intense, filial conversation with you. And today, once again, with ever-growing love and trust, we want to present to you the Church, and so we want to present to you these sons and daughters of yours in Opus Dei, who want nothing for themselves, who don't nourish any ambition for their own selves, because they are deeply convinced that our home is yours, in which people live solely and exclusively for God. Look at each of us, Mother Mary. Look at me, although I am well convinced that I don't deserve the slightest glance from you. But ne respicus peccata mea, said Fida Meirum. Don't look at my failings, which are so numerous, and for which I'm sorry and ashamed and beg for forgiveness. Look at my sons, look at my daughters, look how they love you with the perennial fire of their dedication, which holds no human motives. We are not pursuing any human goal in our self-giving. We have surrendered ourselves because your son was the one who asked us to. Most Holy Virgin, protect the Church, save the Church. And from now on I won't make any suggestions. Up till now I have been telling you things boldly, but always with my head bowed, because I am a dirty rag, although I think I have always tried to act out of love for the wisdom and will of the Blessed Trinity. Our Lady of Guadalupe, Seat of Wisdom, Our Hope, Pray for Us.